today we are at sea we're looking out of our window Woo! and i'm hungover really hungover <laughs> you're struggling aren't you i feel seasick as well i feel awful today everything's woo. i still feel drunk as well <laughs> so what's going to happen now is we're going to go and get some breakfast we're too late for the main dining room yeah so yeah we're just going to go to the sixth street diner it seems to be our Breakfast place, so I'm going to try and get some steak. I think I'm going to go for the steak and the eggs and the potatoes, they were nice. I'm going to try those. I need some coke or lager or something to get. I feel really rough. So, let's go. Good to see you all. Now, are you all aware of the price? <laughs> Most important thing in there. <laughs> The price. So there's currently a 30 minute wait for food at the Sixth Street Diner, but what they've done is they've given us a pager. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to excursions anyway, so we're going to nip down there and we're going to try and book the yellow submarine. You can do that on the screens, we don't even actually see a person. We can just no, do that. We need to so. be person because Why? we're supposed to be doing uh, what we call what? our uh, customs thing. Is that the time we're going on it? Okay, well, well they'll, they'll move, they'll move it, they'll sort it out, they'll figure it out, we'll figure it all out, it's fine. Don't stress people, you're on holiday, and I'm steaming. Look people, the bazaar is fucking down. Oh, this shop's really cool, they got loads, oh, they've got nice clothes in there. Nice. Yeah, so the excursions place is all at the back of the ship. Tropical Adventures, look, Tropical Adventures. Here we are, here we go. Shore experiences. So we booked our trip, and we it's all sorted. And they've said about the customs because we've got to do like a border control immigration, thing, immigration. immigration. So we've got to do that tomorrow. Uh, but that's all sorted. We just move it. We'll whatever. We'll, we'll rearrange. It's fine. Uh, anyway, we're now going to go to the atrium where we wait for our buzzer to go off, which he's got there, and we're just going to get a cruise. Hi everyone. Welcome to episode six of our Pino Arga Caribbean cruise series. <laughs> Oh, we, do you know what we're going to do for our lunch today? No. Gavin knows what's happening, doesn't he? We're going to have gammon beer. Oh, yes, and probably some red wine. We start early today, I don't really care. We'll get early-ish tomorrow. Ish, for this yellow submarine. Oh. 10.45, Yeah, 10.45, it's quite late. Let's give us a bit of a lion. So I now have a seat in the Grand Atrium, and it's really comfy. These seats are actually a lot comfier than they look. They're really nice and soft and spongy and bouncy. <laughs> They're nice. You enjoying your coke? Lovely, thank you. Good, and it's nice. It's nice and refreshing. It's lovely. <laughs> oh, our buzz is going off. <laughs> so our buzz has just gone off. So now it's time for our breakfast. Actually, yes, down one. It wasn't. It wasn't the full time. We got quite quick. It's about ten minutes. That's all it's been. So today, I know exactly what I'm going to go for. I'm going to go for the steak and eggs again. What are you Same. going for? Same. Yeah. Cool. So do you enjoy your food? Really good. Nice. As you can see, it was delicious, everyone. We've eaten it. It's all gone. It's lovely. And now, I love the things on the mugs. It always says something different on them, doesn't it? I'll be out and grooving tonight without coffee. We're just admiring the scenery. It's lovely. I love the deck in this restaurant. It's so nice, isn't it? It's a bit disorientating though when you look up and you see the reflection. They've got like all these, I love the funky signs and all in the windows, it's really cool. And the artworks are quite good as well, aren't they? It's lovely in here. So we just had our breakfast, it was really nice, absolutely chock-a-block stuff now I am. But it's really nice, the steak and the eggs, is lovely. It was really good. And you had that today, didn't you? Um, now we're going to quickly nip to our room to grab our bags, don't we? And we're going to drop off our tickets because we're, we're scared we're going to go in the pool or something, forget that they're in this pocket. They'll fly away when I'm up on the thing. They'll blow away, yeah, they could waft over the edge of the ship, can not he? Because he's going to do, Gavin's going to do the ropes course now, people. He's fun. Yeah, so Gavin's going on his altitude thing in a minute. Uh, I'm not. I'm just going to get, we're going to get Pepsi now, I mean. So we're currently sat at the Panorama Bar, aren't we? Which is like, just below altitude, nice spot. We managed to find a cheer, didn't we? Yes, it's very busy, because it's sunny, it's hot, and everyone wants to sunbathe, so it's busy. Um, but yeah, we haven't struggled to find a cheer. We don't really sunbathe though, to be fair, do we? Not like that. And I'll, if I need sunbathe, I will just sleep on the floor. I don't need to. Yeah, just sunbathe by the pool. You find only sun cream. Being, yeah, all, being safe, yeah. oh yeah, you are probably been up there, I reckon. Yeah. Well, a very good morning everyone, this is the captain speaking from the bridge, where the time is now 12 o'clock noon. And a very good afternoon everyone. Well, since our departure from St. Duche yesterday evening until noon today, 
Are we having a total distance of 143 nautical miles? Our new position is latitude 13 degrees 15.6 minutes north and longitude 59 degrees 42.6 minutes west. This geographically places us some three and a half nautical miles west of the coastline of Barbados, which you can clearly see ahead of us now. So we'll be continuing on this easterly heading, closing with the coastline for the next half an hour or so, and ultimately we will reach our position about 500 metres off Haywards Beach. As I said, this is the location that on the 16th of March, RVO will be officially named by our godmother. In an exclusive, I can update you and inform you that our godmother will be announced in the coming days and weeks. Gavin's going to do this, everyone. New to Piano, the Altitude Skywalk is the place to go if you fancy getting physical and admiring some incredible sea views. Here he goes, he's got to put his harness on. <laughs> Give us a little twirl. Ta da! You're doing your practice one, aren't you? All good? Oh, he's off, he is off. There he is, look, he's making his way up. During our cruise, the Altitude Skywalk was complimentary. However, we've recently learned that P&O are now charging for this. How was it? It was fun. It was fun, was it? It was very windy. Which, which one? The spider web? Yeah. So everyone, we are now watching the practice run for the Neyman so Basically the ship's like really, really close to the shoreline, like super, super close. The beach is over, it looks stunning, it's so nice though. Like look at that, that one there. That's, that's awesome. Looks so nice. So this is literally just, just for the photos and for the Neyman Sarri, like a complete practice. So. Go on then Gav, give it a go, you clearly want to. You're feeling playful today, yeah? Did you miss that on paper? No, I didn't. <laughs> I'll put it on the little stick. Put it, put it on the little, the little thing there, and then give it a go. Okay. Did that go to plan? You happy yeah, with that? That's what I was yeah. Okay. All done. You had enough. Ooh, so. <laughs> We've just been up the top deck, I mean Gavin's done his thing, you did your altitude, and now we're going down to Costa to get a drink. It's rammed up on the top deck, it's full of people. It's such a beautiful day today, and because they're doing that thing as well, it's like chocolate block. So we're going to go down where it's nice and cool, get a Costa. Comfy? We're just sat by the window, yeah, look. Our coolers have arrived. Ta-da! It's gonna be nice. Because you've been, you've been climbing, and I had to stand up the video and for an hour. He was on that people. An hour. Mm -mm -mm. Let's have it. <laughs> nice. So we just had our Costa, and now we're gonna stick our head outside, aren't we? Yeah. See what it's like on the like the prom de prom deck, because the. Topless, absolutely chock a block boost. <laughs> they're not lounge lounges, but you can sit down, can't you? This is the best, but I like walking up the end of here. We're just having a stroll at the moment around the prom deck. It's really nice. It's so hot and sunny, and you can see this is different than Iona. We were just saying they've raised this higher. It's a bit more of a windbreak for yeah. these cabins here, I suppose, because you would you would get it coming straight off, wouldn't you? Enjoying your stroll, Gavin. Yeah, very nice. It's nice, isn't it? In front of the beer now, look at the light, yeah? There's a bar at the end of this, isn't it? If we go all the way down here, you get to the sunset bar. Thank you, that's great, thanks. Oh, lush. So, we just, whoops, we just 
got our drinks. Now we're going to see like a thing, a presentation, aren't we? Like a virtual bridge with a second officer, I think yes. they said. So as we're here, we just figured we'd stick our heads in and see. I didn't think there'd be this many people. There's quite a lot of people in here. So there is our vessel, Argia. To give you some idea of how big this thing is, she is uh, 344 and a half meters long. Bottom picture is our view. We see a lot from the bridge. It's so very tall. Um, we look down on almost everything. It's even other cruise ships. We go to ports and we look down on cruise ships' funnels. So it's quite incredible. So we've just been to see our what was it? Our virtual bridge tour. It was the first officer doing a virtual bridge tour. He was telling us all about the ship. It was absolutely. It was really, really good. Really good. informative. Okay. Anyway. What we're going to do now is we're going to go to the Keelan Cow. Little bag to eat. Get some calendar because it was absolutely delicious. I can't wait. I'm, I'm hungry actually. And then, but and then it's going to be You should see out here. It's a beautiful afternoon. That's lovely, isn't it? And the sun's out. It's boiling hot. It's lovely. Mm -hmm. So we are now at the Keelan Cow, haven't we, Gav? Oh, yes. <laughs> we have ordered our food. We, we know what we're going for. We're going to go for the cheese. We're going to shear, aren't we? Yeah, and we're going to go for like bread. a flatbread each. That's what we're going to have. And uh, Gavin's ordered this enormous, massive, like, what is it? Like a keg or beer. A beer, an ale? I don't even know what he's ordered, people. Um, he gave up on his red wine, so yeah. Muggins here has to. I'm being forced to drink it now. But it's lovely in here. It's like really nice, really relaxed. Um, it's actually quite quiet now, I think, because people are actually going back to their rooms to pack. Because some people get off tomorrow, but we don't. So it's kind of nice for us. So I may have messed up. I said, um, may have. I thought it was going to be like a flat, a flat, a flat bread, like a normal flat bread. But look, it's like a pizza. And I was going to dip it in the cheese. I may have messed up. And we asked for it all to come out at the same time as well, didn't we? I'm going to Gavin's tucking in. Oh, look at this, people. Look at this. Oh, look at the cheesiness. It's pure heaven. Mm, happy. <laughs> so this little piggy has cut up his pizza into strips. And I fold it like that. And then look at this. Good. Just an update. This is absolutely delicious. Bit of an overkill, but it's delicious. Are you enjoying yours? It's really good. Stuffed, Luke. Stuffed. Is that what you call it? <laughs> be rolling me off. I'm not going to be able to fly back. They will have to pay excess weight on the plane. God, that was nice, wasn't it? So we had a lovely meal in the Keelan Cow. So it was so good. We're absolutely chock a block stuff now. Anyway, we're going to go up on the top deck now for a little walk, breath fresh air, and just look at all the pools and see the sunset. In case you were wondering, seven laps of the jogging track equal one mile. Enjoying our walk, and we are by the funnel. We've had loads of fun, we've been just exploring, we haven't we? And now we're going down to our favourite bar, which is the swim up bar. We love it, don't we? Oh, this is nice, I do like this. I always feel like when I come down those steps, I always feel like shouting, I hope we enjoy our time together. Because that's what Carl says on Titanic, doesn't he? When he's going down <laughs> and she's run away with a coat. And he goes, <laughs> And he says, What could possibly be funny? And he goes, I put the diamond in the coat. We put the coat on here. Literally, that's what that reminds me of. <laughs> <laughs> Where's my room? This one here. Oh. Nice. Oh, that's lovely, isn't it? Look at that. Look at that. It's, nice. it's the rum on board, isn't it? Yes. Tidal. Is it Tidal? Yes, Tidal rum. rum. It's the Coke. It's not even that wavy. It doesn't feel that wavy, but then you're in here. Look at it. I've lost half the corner, haven't we? I was up to my waist. Look at that. 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 Look
Tears in the toilet in here, it's like that's the chain keeps flushing and flushing, doesn't it? So we enjoyed some drinks at the the swim up bar over there. It's awesome, I love it. It's really wavy today. We've been drinking I've been drinking the tidal rum, which is the rum they make on board, it's really nice. And Gavin's just had some Marabella gin, haven't you? So yeah, now we're gonna go to the room and we're gonna get ready for tonight. Ta -da! Ta -da! We're all changed, we're all fresh, we're all tidy and snazzy and dressed up, ready to go. Tonight we're hoping to go to the Olive Grove, so fingers crossed we will get in the queue. Uh, I think to start off the night we're going to get some drinks maybe at the Glass House yeah, in, the, in the Grand Atrium. There's also the Amber uh, Bar and Lounge at the bottom, mm -hmm. so we could go there if we're that's full. Uh, failing that we could just go to the back, we're thinking we might go to the Sunset Bar if that's still open, the one at the very back outside. We find we'll somewhere. find somewhere for let's, let's try let's Glass House first. Yeah, let's go, let's go. Mm -hmm. She went for Boom Boom, did you? And I went for Pinot Grigio. Nice. So now we're going to the Olive Grove. So we're in the Olive Grove. And we're wrapped by the window, aren't we? Where's Gavin? He's there. So I've decided what I'm going to go for. Sorry about the noise, it's very, very busy in here. I'm going to go for this one, the Italian antipasti is what I'm going to go for to start. And then I'm going to go for this, this one down here. So for me, I'm going to go for the Portuguese salt cod fish cake to start. And then the spaghetti carbonara. So what is it? Crab cake. Yeah, crab cake. Fish cake. Fish cake. Oh, nice. Oh, is that like hollandaise sauce? Nice. Good. I've, I've just gone for like an antipasti, so we've got like some tomatoes and some ham basically, and just loads of little knickknacks. So now our main courses have arrived. Ta -da! We've had our stars, haven't we? They look quite nice. And now I, so I went for these, look. It's a bit like a kebab basically. It's a kofta, isn't it? And you went for a pasta, which looks really yeah, nice. That looks really tasty, actually. Okay, so we've had our mains, and now we're going to go for our pudding. And I'm going to go for the Sicilian lemon tart. And Gavin's going for the cheesecake. the rose petal cheesecake at the bottom. So that's what Gavin's going for. So I went for the Sicilian lemon tart. It's nice, it's very tart, <laughs> it's very tangy. And Gavin went for the rose petal cheesecake. Is it nice? Not too happy, you don't sound convinced. It's been my least favourite meal in the cruise. Oh. Yeah, it's not been our favourite this time round, is it? Like it's, it's mu it was much better on Iona. I think they've changed the menu as well because now it's all included as well. And it's more of a main dining room. It's very, very busy in here, it's a lot busier than Iona. It's very loud, but you know, yeah, it's all right though. I, mean, I like that. It's probably the first pudding I've actually had on the ship, isn't it? Well, one of them. I haven't had many puddings. Not this time. It's been really good. It's been good. Yeah. It's good. Yeah. To be honest, it's quite light food, isn't it? And I'm glad because we've eaten quite a lot today. We had too much earlier on. We over overdone the keel and cow, didn't we? What's the crisps? They look like crisps. It's a pastry. It's phyllo crisps. Phyllo crisps. Phyllo pastry crisps. Is that actually meant to be? Yeah, is that what it says? Interesting. I like lemon. But just now and again, it just makes me go, ooh. Cleanse the palate. Yeah, yeah. It's like kitchen cleaner. No. <laughs> no, it's not bad. It's nice. I know what you mean. <laughs> Hi everyone. Hello. So we thought we'd come outside and fill you in. Um, we had a, a nice meal, it was good. Very, very busy in there though, very crowded. Probably couldn't hear, word Probably couldn't hear what we were saying, this, which is why we've decided to come out here and talk about it. 
and we're trying to find a spot out the wind. No, it was quite nice. I enjoyed it. It was all right. It was good. I always find Gilbert Grove overrated anyway. No, I liked it. I really liked it on my own. It was good. But they've, they've made the menu. It's like all included now. There's no any additional charge at all, which is kind of good, but the food isn't as good though. So I'd rather pay for it, if that makes sense, and have what we had on Iona, but they've also turned it into a main dining room. Yeah. They're sort of going down the route of like Royal Caribbean and Celebrity, where they've got a themed restaurant as a main dining room, which is all good. But I think, yeah, I think they'd be better off charging for it. Or even putting like, they didn't have the baklava on there. You would get Which I was that. devastated about. I would have paid for that. Cause I mean, last time it was only like two quid, wasn't it? Yeah. But it was really, really tasty. It was just a bit of a shame, a bit disappointed, but you know, it doesn't always work out. No. We're not whinging. We had a nice meal, but would I rush back? Probably not. I would. What we're doing now is we're going for a little stroll on the prom deck. Look, ta -da. So yeah, we're just yeah. having a little walk we are. Taking in the fresh air. Cause that's one thing we love about the Caribbean. It's nice and warm. It's lovely. Boiling that, yeah? Yeah. So, and look, these are the lovely infinity hot tubs, but they close. They close. They're open. We were saying eight, eight till eight. They are, and they're closed now because it's now. What time are we now? We're like about twenty past ten, are we? Twenty past ten. Yeah. Something like that. What happens? Oh, the decks closed. You can't go to the front. Oh. Oh, we can't do a whole lap. Whilst bumbling about out on deck, we decided to take some cheeky photos. Nothing professional, just a bit of fun. So now, now we're going to see the show. We're going to go to the theatre, aren't we? Space. What's it called? Festival. Festival. We're going to stick on. We're going to have a look at that, aren't we? So we stuck our heads in at the show, which was the festival show. I thought it was all right, but it was, it was quite busy. Well, I say quite busy, we came quite late. So we decided to just stand at the back. And now we're in the Amber Lounge and I'm going to get an espresso martini. Uh, and you have one as well, are you? Yes, I'm so good. Gavin's the same. So yes, we're going to have an espresso martini. And then we're going to go up and see, there's another show up in the Sky Dome, isn't there? Yes. So we're going to go up and see that. What's that one called, Play? Uh, play. Yeah. So we're going to see that now. Thank you so much. Yeah. That's great. Oh, lovely, that's great. Ooh, look, I am back in action for now. Cheers, people. Cheers. Nice. That's gorgeous. It's good, is it? Yeah. Good. It's weird because it's like sweet. It's like a pudding, isn't it? It's like a, tr like a truffle, like a chocolate. Yeah. Mm, it's nice. It's cold. Yeah, it's refreshing. Yeah, it's nice. So now we're going up to the Sky Dome to see play, wherever that is. That'll be interesting. Let's check it out. So we watched the show, what was it called? Oh, play, play, which was actually really quite good. And it was really awesome because they, they, um, there was like this lifeguard thing and he dived in the pool. They actually incorporated the pool into the show, which is really good. And then there was someone doing like, what do you call it with the ropes? Is it a trapeze? No, uh, where they do the- Aerial acrobatic things. Yeah, the aerial acrobatic things. Yeah, but she was spinning around and we've been up here, we are, we've been chatting. It's a really nice, even look, the lid is off. And it's really warm, I honestly, I know we keep raving on about it, but it's so nice being in the Caribbean, isn't it? it is. And this is a lovely, lovely area. We're so pleased with the ship, aren't we? Just look at it. It's awesome. So what we're doing, we're because we're up the top deck, we're just gonna have a brief little stroll around before we go to bed. We are enjoying our evening stroll, aren't we? It's, nice. it's really lovely. relaxed, it's so nice out. Oh, it's lovely, oh, so fresh. The thing is, because we've got an inside as well, it is nice to get a bit of fresh air. So we just come back to the room and Gavin 
since fallen asleep. I was watching telly, I was. I forgot to say goodbye to you all, so I'm saying goodbye to you now. We really hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please give it a thumbs up. And we'd be really grateful if you kindly consider subscribing to our channel. That would just be awesome. We would love it. And then we'll see you tomorrow when we go on our little submarine trip. <laughs> Bye, people. Thanks for watching.